So, who will stand behind the real one? The real one that has faced and made you who you are. See, you're off spending money that I'll probably never see. Fancy cars, nice houses, vacations. We'll call it dirty money. I can play it off as just a dream, but I know it wasn't. For the last three years, I have taken a lot of shit without even I've taken a lot of shit. I've went through the slaughterhouse. I've been burnt, set ablaze. I've had nukes dropped on me days after fucking days. I hit rock bottom. I cannot count the ways that you tried to fuck me. Because when you're on the roller coaster ride that I was on, Anyone would want to have that feeling. Anyone would want to be there. Anyone would want to try to knock you off that that feeling that you have. And you have the world I, in your fingertips. Not only did I do everything right when I had the world in my fingertips, I, I people started to look to me thinking that I was the problem. They started to pick me apart. And now, even after I've given them more money than I could ever imagine, through, through the marketing, through everything that through getting put through basically hell, I have nothing to show for it. See, when I first started to try to do this, when I was first getting into this, I wanted to be able to do what I love and help whoever I, I, I could along the way. And that's what I was out for. So when I first started doing this, I contacted Extra Life, BC Children's Hospital, and I tried to, like I said, help whoever I possibly could with what I had. I wasn't using it as some sort of method to get to the top. I wasn't using it I wasn't using it with any ill means. Let's put it that way. I was like I said, I wanted to do what I love and I wanted to help whoever I possibly could. I wasn't using it at all. I'm not that type of person. So people can play me off every which way at this point. I don't fucking care. taken on all that you could throw and that's one thing that you took away from me was the fact that you know you played me off as a bad guy for, for long enough And now, the same people that I helped get them money, get them in the, a better position to where they're at now, they would rather just leave the knife in my back and fucking walk away and give up. Because apparently I didn't add up to the type, type of person that they expected of, of me. And the person that, that I am is not good enough for them. Now... I didn't expect to get to where I was. Let's put it that way. I wanted to go through the proper steps to be able to build myself up through the, the community. I didn't know who the fuck I was. 
I didn't know I was being recorded this whole entire fucking time. That people were just wanting to feed more into my fucking life and and try to basically feed more into a story. I didn't know any of this. And you can t you can play that off as diabolical. You can play that off as being an evil genius. You can play that off as being decept deceptive. Whatever the fuck you want at this point. Because the fact is, that type of thing stands for everything I hate. You basically break through the walls of people's privacy to be able to get to where you're at. And I'm pretty sure there's people out there that would agree with that. Let's just put it this way. I want to be the one to reach the next level, to be able to make sure you don't do this to anyone else. That's who I want to be. That's who I am. Because when you're in this game, any mis wrong mistake you make, people will try to bury you as much as possible, try to play you off as the worst possible thing, try to fucking pick you apart like a fucking buzzard. And you're just some fucking corpse on the fucking ground. I've gone through your fucking war. I've gone through your fucking maze. I've faced all that you could throw at me for fucking three years. And still, I'm no further than I was when I started. The only thing that I can actually get out of this is I have no regrets at what I've done because I have change the world, but no one fucking believes me. No one's going to believe me, because unless you're involved with this fucking world, everyone thinks you're just fucking crazy. The worst part about all this is you took my chance away at being a hero for where I have come from and what I have faced. You'd much rather just fucking write me off after all this. Because I'm not the one that can be replaced. I'm not some homey, know me, some phony that you're playing off as being me. There's no replacing me in the story that I've given you and everything I've done for you over the last few years. Past the three years. As if you didn't guess it already, yeah, I'm the the I can't even fucking say it. I'm the <laughs> I am the one, the only I can't fucking be replaced because I know the game inside and out. I've made people in the game who they are today because of me. So keep playing me off as being some nobody that you've never met before, some little fucking whore, some white piece of trash. Fuck you.